Hi guys, Mighty Mr. Mustache here, the mightiest mustache in the universe. It is the 4th of July in 2017, a reset day on Destiny, Independence Day in the United States. If you're listening in the States, have a great day, play safe, play nice, and happy Independence Day. Uh, we are back with reset for this week. What's going on? Let's find out. Jump right on in. We've got... Uh, Okay, they haven't jumped the day break. I think that's going to be for the month of August. I just wanted to check on that. I was, uh, wasn't was 100% sure, and I hadn't bothered to go back and look at the info. Okay, starting with the weekly featured raid, we have King's Fall. Six-man raid, 390 light. As always, the three challenges came with the very first challenge modes uh, that were ever introduced. So Golgoroth challenge. Oryx Challenge and War Priest Challenge. Uh, we've gone through what all of these are. I'm not going to waste your time with them and go into detail. Golgoroth, every member of the team has to take his gaze at least once during the cycle. Oryx Challenge, stack up 16 orbs, detonate them all at the same time. And the War Priest Challenge is the same person cannot take the buff twice. That's uh, become a, a feature of some of the challenges because that features in the Crota Challenge as well. When you're fighting Crota for the challenge mode, the same person cannot take the sword twice. Uh, if you're still doing Challenge of Elders and you're still having fun with it, this week is Grenade O'Clock. The problem is trickle, meaning you will not get grenades back quickly. Fantastic if you're a Void Walker uh, with really good, what's it called, energy drain. Chaff means no radar, but what are you going to do? That's not a, such a big deal. Uh, the grenades, again, the fact that it's trickle means it's going to be tricky. But give it your best. Uh, if you're really, really that concerned about getting top scores and stuff this late in the Destiny series, chances are you haven't been playing it at all anyway. Uh, I'll jump into the Nightfall and take a look at it in a sec. The Crisis Heroic Strike for the week. We have Juggler. Ammo does not drop for the weapon you currently have. So if you're blasting with your hand cannon, you will not have any primary ammo drop only secondary and heavy and the same all the way down so you have to keep swapping weapons or you will run out of ammo for one of them uh, airborne double damage while well, your feet are not touching the ground you do double damage not the other way around that's grounded catapult oh that would be fun over here uh catapult is your grenades recharge significantly faster like three times faster it's pretty good the weekly story playlist, the Iron Lords are gone. It's up to you to finish their mission. So it's the uh, the last the last uh, story, the last DLC, the Rise of Iron. Heroic, of course, small arms, double damage with your primary weapon, and match game. Whatever has shields has better shields. You need to match the energy type or do almost no damage. Uh, they're always, these are always worth doing if you want those last treasures of the ages to fill out sets and the like. It's kind of good, kind of cool. The sets are pretty neat. And this week's PvP, Mayhem Rumble. Ooh, free-for-all mayhem. Uh, do not go into this one looking for, you know, uh, highly competitive, phenomenally tactical play. This is 100% the definition of anarchy and chaos. But it's, it's fun at the same time. You just If you're willing to laugh off the stupidity of getting uh, super killed by four or five times in a row just because, that's the way it goes. And the Nightfall, finally. We have Specialist, double damage from special weapons. Juggler, so no, no ammo for the thing you're using. You can't just use your special weapon all the time. Chaff, no radar. That can be tough in the Nightfall. Stuff can sneak up on you pretty easily. And Ironclad, more enemies that would not normally have shields now have them. The shields aren't any tougher than usual, so you're going to see Shanks with solar shields. You're going to see... Uh, little uh, taken scions or regular scions with shields um, a couple of other things what else has shielding the I think some of the knights or some of the acolytes will also have shields that kind of thing let's jump in and see what the actual nightfall is and then I won't waste any more of your time I will get on with my day you can get on with yours it's a gorgeous day here in Montreal I am taking my daughter out for lunch Maybe do some shopping in Chinatown.
The Vex have restarted their world eating oh, machine cool. in a bid to restore their nexus. Return to in the time, nexus mine. Venus will be consumed. Or the restorative mine. Yeah, Return to the this. Black Garden, basically. Scouts report that the Vex have oh no, the this mine. one. Yeah, it's jump off the big class. cliffs. My stomach lurches every time you make this jump. I don't even have a stomach. No. Just Sweet. Support my favorite guardian. With no energy burns, this is actually going to be take pretty that easy. Mind apart. One of the hardest parts about this mission is the fact that you're in fairly close quarters and there isn't much space to move around. So if it has like a solar or an arc burn, you tend to get beat up pretty badly. Uh, you know, just because, again, there's nowhere to mess around. Um, so that's it. I'm not going to go and solo this mission in here because there's no reason to. If I can get the boys on to play, we will do some Fireteam Black Watch and the Nightfall mission this evening or this afternoon. Let's get back to orbit. And that's it. I'm not going to go through too much more. We have only a short time, about eight weeks left. Almost exactly eight weeks left until the drop of Destiny 2. I am excited about it now that I have a new microphone set up for my PC and can do some better narrated videos. I will be posting my views on what's going to be coming up on Destiny 2. Keep an eye on my channel for more of that. Until then, as, have a great 4th of July down in the States. Have a great Tuesday, July the 4th, and the rest of the world if you're listening. Uh, play safe, play nice, have a great day, have some great gaming.